Exercise 12. Insert headers and footers. Print presentation handouts. Part of the PowerPoint 2007 exam prep guide brought to you by Shift Key Solutions. In this exercise, we'll be looking at the types of printouts we can make in our PowerPoint slideshow. It happens to be three types that we can print out slides, we can print out notes, or we can print out handouts that include notes. So our first step here is to get to our headers and footers dialog box. We're going to come to our insert tab and then over in the text group we're going to click header and footer. That will open our header and footer dialog box. We have two tabs available to us. Here in our slide tab we're going to come down to slide number. And then to keep our title slide clean meaning that there are no footers on our title slide, we're going to come down to Don't Show on Title Slide and then click Apply to All. When we do, it closes our dialog box. Well, from here we want to go back to our text group and click Header and Footer and come to our Notes and Handouts so that we can modify those printouts. From here we want to include a date because that's important information when we pass out the handouts of our slideshow we're going to choose date and time and then we're going to choose update automatically so that whenever we print this out the date will always be current. From here we're going to include the page number and also a footer. As I click each one of these you'll notice that the preview shows me where these will be located on my handout. And in my footer I'm going to type in the title of this file. And in this case, the title includes my first and last name at the end of it. From here, I simply click Apply to All. And then let's take a look at what this will appear as when we print it out. We're going to go to our Office button and go to Print Preview. So we're going to come to Print and then click Print Preview. And right now, it's showing me my slide as to how it will print. And you'll notice this is my title slide and there's nothing on the footer. If I come down one slide to slide 2, I can see here is my slide number, slide 2. If I come to slide 3, here's slide 3, slide 4, and so on. However, this is my slide printout and it's not a very effective or efficient printing method because this will print a slide on an entire sheet of paper. We don't want that. We're going to change that. In the Page Setup group, under the Print What section, I'm going to click my drop down here and instead of Slides, I'm going to change it to Handouts, four slides per page. And there it is. This gives me a view of how it will print out for my handouts. And I can see my date is here in my header and my file name is down here in the left and my slide number is also here on the bottom right corner. Now if I go to the next page, I can see I'm on page two and here are my slides, which makes for a cleaner printout. There's only two pages to print out because there's only eight slides. So I'm going to click close to return to normal view. And that's it. And it's that easy. That concludes exercise 12, insert headers and footers, print presentation handouts. Thanks for joining me. Next will be exercise 13, add speaker notes and print note pages.